Fire. Some people believe it was discovered here in Western New York at the Hamburg Fairgrounds. That's part of the backstory behind the Hamburg Burger Fest taking place today. And the festival isn't the only way that community is tapping into its unique identity. Jackie Roberts gives us a look at the project meant to catch your attention and your taste buds when you head into the South Towns. You've probably driven past this water tower numerous times, and maybe you've even noticed that it's shaped exactly like a hamburger. And many community members think it should be painted like one too. It just always has been that way when they build it. So why not take advantage of it? Transforming the Hamburg water tower into America's favorite sandwich has been an idea for years. But it wasn't until recently that the concept turned into a plan. Just days ago, the group trying to make it happen got their tax exempt status approved by the IRS. Now fundraising season is well underway. After all, the price tag is about $1 million. Well, we've got a lot of grassroots support, but really the big money is going to have to come from our Buffalo-based corporations. As you go around the country, you will see ketchup bottles of water towers and peaches of water towers. No reason why not to have a hamburger in Hamburg. That's why they're selling these t-shirts at the Hamburg Burger Fest and seeking donations. Organizers say it's the perfect event to promote what could be a piece of the community's future while celebrating a unique part of its past. We have the Burger Fest because we are the home of the hamburger. Legend has it Hamburg held its first Burger Fest in 1985 to celebrate the 100th anniversary of the birth of the hamburger, supposedly created on the Hamburg Fairgrounds in 1885. Those in favor of the Burger Tower say it's more than just a fun idea, but also an opportunity for economic development through tourism. These iconic infrastructure projects, they exist all across the United States and people travel to see them. So we believe that if we paint it, they will come here to the South Towns. Organizers say Erie County brings in $2 billion in tourism every year. Their hope is that when people are in western New York for a Bills game or to see the falls, they'll make a special trip to the South Towns to see the water tower, or maybe eventually the other way around. Jackie Roberts, Channel 2 News.